Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. I just woke up. 100,000. Yay! Yay! Yay. <laughs> Alright, go back to sleep. Where do you need shit? <laughs> 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 that was the ugliest laugh I've ever heard in my life, bro. <laughs> Marty Son, Eric here. Welcome back to another video. Thank you guys so much for a hundred thousand subscribers. I really appreciate you all. And thank you for enabling me to even make this video. I mean, you'll understand what I mean by that later. Anyway, uh, because we hit 100,000, I will be doing a giveaway, but I will announce that at the end of the video, so stick around for that if you want to be included in the giveaway. This video is actually my PC setup tour, but uh, because people expect me to eat, I think the first six minutes are going to be me eating. But if you don't wanna watch that, you can just skip directly to this time. I'm going to show you guys everything that I bought for my PC setup. I'll link everything in the description as well. Make sure you click on those links if you are also interested in buying. Nothing in this video is sponsored. I fucking wish it was. It would be fucking sick if it was. But I'm going to walk you guys through everything that I bought, how everything is set up, and then I'm going to talk about future plans with the setup because, you know, I do want to stream. Well, I am streaming, and I'll talk about that more as well at the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoy. Vamos. What you making? Oh shit, bro. Chill with that. Welcome to the Money Sign Viv cooking channel. You guys are watching a master at work. You cut that bacon like a fucking pro, baby. Hey, Terry. Hello. Hi, Terry. You guys are probably wondering, why is Viv the only one in the kitchen cooking? That's because behind the scenes, I did all the chopping, all the setting up, all that. Viv's just cooking right now because she woke up and she said, Eric, like, I really want to cook for you because I love you so much. So let me make breakfast for you and then you can make dinner. And I was like, you know what, Viv? Sounds like a great trade. Also, got a new couch. Got a lot of new things in this video. So this is the old couch, right? This is the new couch. It's fucking enormous and it's beautiful. You're so fucking cute, man. You're so cute, chicken leg. This breakfast is actually something that Viv and I cook up a lot. It's just like a bunch of meats and veggies together. And then you toss it all together with an English muffin and eggs. And with hot sauce, it's a pretty good meal. Some breakfast. So I made some Italian sausage with bacon, jalapenos, onions, mushrooms, with some eggs and an English muffin. And we also have some broccoli cheddar soup from Costco. It's a nice day for soup because it is snowing outside. There's a snowstorm that hit New York. I'm sure on the other parts of the East Coast, but this is what it looks like outside. Let it go, let it go, go. <coughs> first bite, here we go. This first bite is dedicated to Eli Goaty, who donated $10 on Twitch, even though I don't do Twitch for money. Thank you, Eli. Mmm. Mmm. Dip the English muffin in the broccoli cheddar, first bite. Mmm. The broccoli cheddar is so fucking good. Mmm. Mmm. What's the plan for today? Well, I'm gonna eat this. I don't know. I'll figure it out, actually. You just put your dirty fork in the soup, and you just got all your shit in there. Sorry about that. My fault. When's our date? So Viv actually requested a date today because... She wants to feel uh, loved and appreciated. No, I just don't want to be trapped at home. I feel like you're just uh, releasing all the shit in the night. So it just feels really nice. I'll tell you. Hmm? You look grossed out. Yeah. Hi, the rest of us. Dinner time, and we ordered sushi, Uber Eats. It's like fucking, we're snowed in right now, so. And we also didn't want to cook. But uh, we just ordered this big ass sashimi platter with some sushi and some rolls, as well as some spicy tuna and salmon. And that's gonna be a good ass fucking meal. I mean, sushi from Uber Eats is always a good meal, you know? It looks really good. It does look really good. Mmm, I'm salivating right now, My fuck. Goodness. Okay, so this one is tuna and avocado. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> All right, first bite, here we go. Cheers. Mmm, 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 That's good sushi. Mmm, disclaimer, I've never had like sushi omakase 
or like you know that high-end sushi in New York so any sushi that tastes like decent is good sushi to me all right I'm not a sushi snob this is the unagi I fucking love eel so I have high hopes for this cheers first bite mmm solid fish bro here is a regular ass spicy tuna roll first bite Dude, this fish is better than what I usually order. Mm -hmm. It's better than Mora. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, wait. Let me show you guys what the restaurant is called. It's called Sake Tumi Asian Bistro in Brooklyn. And it's fire. Next up, we got the uh, the shrimp sushi. First bite. He First <laughs> bite. Here we go. Mmm. No, this should be good. Not good shit. You don't like it? I'm allergic. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we also got a raw tuna roll. I feel so bad for you guys. You guys are probably eating, like, some dry-ass chicken. Can someone tell me what uh, fish this is? I don't know what sashimi this is, but uh, let me know. We'll see if it tastes good. I've never seen this in my life. First bite, here we go. Oh, oh, never mind. I've had it. I just don't know what it's called. What is it called, though? Tell me. Is this snapper? Red snapper? Maybe. Hey. This is Snapper, right? Let me know. First bite, here we go. That one's good. We're gonna watch One Piece now while we eat, so. That already looks swollen. I'll see you guys tonight. <laughs> so that was a fucking lie. Before we get started, let me show you guys my current fucking setup. And don't get me wrong, I am very privileged and blessed to even have a laptop, specifically a MacBook. It gets everything that I need done, done and I can game on it, I can work on it. It's just that specifically for gaming, it's not the best. It's a shitty setup and I've been playing on a laptop for like my entire life. So it's about goddamn time we upgrade. Dusty as fucking school keyboard. I've had this keyboard since I was like, I wanna say in high school. I got an okay mouse, but I also got this dusty as mouse pad that I have not cleaned since like, Sophomore year of college. People in my Discord tell me that this is like dried up sweat. You can literally write on it, bro. Nasty. And of course, I got my MacBook. This is, I do all my work on this. I play games on it. it, it it's okay, it's nice. It's just not the best, you know? On this side, this is like all of Viv's stuff. This is her work computer, her work phone, all of this random shit. But it, it makes a pretty messy workspace, you know? and gaming space. But that is all about to change today. Let's fucking go, I am so excited. I'm going to clear everything from it and then wipe it down and we'll get set up. All right, so now it is time to build my PC and I actually have a confession to make. Uh, I bought a pre-built. Now, before you flame me, just know that I was advised to get a pre-built because I wanted to get a PC ASAP. I didn't want to wait for parts or pay an overpriced price, you know? Please read before turning on your system. Oh, fuck. Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I'm fucking terrified that I'm going to break something. Carefully and gently remove the protective packing foam from inside the system, okay? Everything looks good. <laughs> Wait, is that it? Is that all I have to do? I think that's it. <laughs> and now I just slide this shit back in, right? Now that it's here, let's uh, let's peel this shit. Ooh, you guys like that ASMR? Next up, the power cable. Put it in right here. Does it turn on though? How do I turn it on? Oh, right here. Oh fuck. Yeah, I don't really give a shit about the lights, but that's cool. That's dope. The next thing we need is display, right? So we got two monitors right here. So this is what we're working with. We got two 24 inch Dell gaming monitors, 144 Hertz. Not really sure what that means either, but let's open it up. Oh, fuck. Oh, that is much bigger than a, a fucking MacBook. Let's fucking go. Oh my God. Hell yeah. So I just gotta click this shit in. I gotta push this in. Oh, that was simple. 
Let's fucking go. Okay. That's so big. Let me do the uh, the second one and then we'll power everything up. That's crazy. Look at all this fucking screen real estate. That is fucking crazy. I'm not sure if this is the best way to configure them. I definitely don't think I want it to be like straight in a line. I have it crooked here a little bit, but it's not flush. I think that might bother me a little bit in the future, but it's fine for now. Or should I just make them flat? I don't know. Here's what it looks like for now. Got the two monitors. They are plugged into the surge protector and I am about to attach the display port cables. Okay. Also, we wanna keep our cables neat. So Viv got me these cable locks and I'm going to use them. I'm just not sure exactly how I'm gonna configure everything yet, but I'll show you guys at the end of the video. All right, I got everything set up now. Well, not everything, but the monitors and the PC, they're all hooked in. Uh, the monitors are connected to the PC. So let's just see if it works. Also, I decided to move the PC this way. Sacrifice a little legroom right here, but it gives some open legroom here for Viv when she wants to watch me play video games or just sit next to me. All right, let's turn this shit on. Three, two, one. Very nice. All right, let me set this shit up. Nice. I am filming. So right now I'm setting up my monitors and I actually have a bunch of Discord people helping me out because I can't do this shit on my own. Hey, you gotta let us know it. Follow my OnlyFans at Money Sign Eric, $15 a month. Thank you. So now my PC is up and running. The monitor's working, everything's set up. My Discord helped me, um, you know, make changes to Windows and all that. But I have a lot more to set up because this is going to be a streaming setup, but I will show you guys that tomorrow when it's light out because I don't want to record everything like in the dark. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. The time is now 12, 10 AM and I am extremely sad because my PC broke. The, uh, apparently the power supply just cut out completely, so it doesn't even turn on now. And I am returning it tomorrow. I set everything up and uh, I just had to take it out because it broke. It's right there right now. I'm gonna return it tomorrow. Fortunately, my Discord server has a bunch of PC gods, mainly a guy named uh, Luigi, <laughs> which is fucking hilarious because his name is Luigi, but I'm gonna go to Micro Center tomorrow. Uh, he gave me some recommendations on some other pre-builds to buy and I'm gonna get a new one. Really sad, because I really wanted to play uh, League tonight, but what can you do? So I'll see you guys tomorrow. What is up guys, good morning. I actually just came back from Micro Center. I did not vlog it unfortunately though, just because I didn't feel like it, sorry. But uh, it was really cool inside, right Viv? Yeah. Yeah, it was actually really fucking cool inside. If I wasn't there to buy a PC, I would have spent like, Probably an hour minimum in there. Also, everyone who worked in Micro Center looked exactly like how I expected them to look, to be honest. I did cop a new PC, and I'm about to show you guys. Warning, uh, it is a pre-built. Sorry about that. A bit more expensive than my old PC that broke down, but my thought process was I may as well invest in something future-proof that's going to last me a while, and it's going to be a PC that I won't have to upgrade. So let me show you guys the unboxing. Yeah, I'm doing unboxings now, man. It's funny. I have no idea what this PC is off the top of my head, but here's what it's called on the Micro Center website if you guys are interested. I'll put a link to it as well for you guys. All right. Three, two, one. Wow. Let's fucking go. All right. I think I can change the colors. Yeah, but... We'll stick to RGB because otherwise I get flamed. The cable management honestly is not ideal, like even for me. It's just kind of like all the wires are kind of hidden behind this leg, but I mean, it'll do for now. It fits all my needs. I'm not gonna be anal about it, <laughs> anal. I apologize in advance, but everything you just saw was an absolute waste of your time because my setup looks nothing like that anymore. I just wanted to put that content in there so that we could make this video longer and run more ads. But I'm about to walk you through my actual setup. It took a few days because all the parts had to come in and all that. But uh, yeah, everything is about done now and I don't think there are any improvements to be made. Well, any immediate improvements 
because I'm fairly content with what I have right now. And as I'm walking you guys through the PC setup, I will name every single piece of equipment that is there, how much it costs, and the link for each of them will be in the bio. The very first change we made to our setup was getting a new chair. This is the Steel K Series 2 chair. Super comfortable, definitely recommend, although I don't have much to compare it to. And also before I show you guys the rest of my setup, I would like to say thank you so much for watching and supporting me because without you guys, I would not have been able to even afford all of this and set this up, which is crazy because getting a PC has always been a dream of mine. So thank you for letting me accomplish that. The first thing you see on the table is probably the Dell 24 inch 144 Hertz dual monitors. These are held up by the Vivo dual monitor stand. It clamps to the end of the table and it's really nice because it's really flexible and allows for freedom of movement with the monitor screens. We also got a desk mat because it was desperately needed and I got a new mouse, the Logitech G Pro X Super Light, which is wireless and it usually goes to the right side but it's currently charging right now. And we also got a new keyboard, which was a huge upgrade, pretty vanilla keyboard, the Razer TKL. But again, anything is an upgrade. And I don't know why I'm clicking here because you can't hear it. For the headset, we got the HyperX Cloud 2 series and it's a wired headset, but I needed to get an extension cable because the PC was too far from where I sit. And this cable right here leads up to the Logitech Z207 stereo speakers for when I'm not using my headset, very convenient. Not the greatest speakers, but it gets the job done. Got some charging wires here down where the extension cables are. And I also do have Cat6 Ethernet running across my room to connect to my Verizon Fios router. This is a 50 foot cable, which was more than enough. And a lot of people told me or recommended that I do connect to the Ethernet. And I can say that it definitely does make a difference. The last few things we have in our setup are a C920X HD webcam, which is for streaming as well as an adjustable webcam stand as well as the accompanying InnoGear microphone boom arm. And this big ass dildo is the HyperX Quadcast microphone. And both these pieces of equipment are for when I stream. For those of you that aren't in my Discord or follow my Instagram, yes, I do stream on Twitch at Money Sign Eric. I stream every day from 7 p.m. to whenever Eastern time. Although if you are watching this video when it was uploaded, I will not be streaming from February 3rd to the 6th because I will be busy. Also, I did get some LED lights, which are behind my monitors, and this is my lighting source for when I stream. And they're called Gobi LED lights, and they are remote controlled through Bluetooth on your phone, and they're, it's, it's pretty nice, pretty solid. Anyway, going back to streaming, like I said, every weekday at 7 p.m. Eastern time, not sure on weekends yet, but join my Discord or follow my Instagram for content updates, or just follow the Twitch. As for what I do on Twitch, I am not completely sure yet. There is a lot of chatting because I'm trying to build a community right now, and I also do some eating, playing video games. But right now, I have been very into Valorant. So that is what I have been doing. Well, what the fuck? Okay, Jesus right. fuck, sorry. Dude, I thought it was like a nuke. Holy <laughs> shit. Okay. Why are you dodging in real life? Because it helps you with the reaction. <laughs> Peaky. In fact, if you were watching this video the day that it was uploaded, chances are I'm probably live on Twitch right now. So if you like what you see, come check it out at Money Sign Eric. It'll be a great time and feel free to ask me any questions or say whatever you want to me. And of course, donations are accepted. No refunds, by the way. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a lot of stuff to say for the outro, but let me start off with the giveaway. Let me show you guys what the giveaway entails. First up, we got AirPod Pros. Yep, this is the real deal. Some real shit right here has not been opened yet. So I'm going to be giving away a pair of these wax strips that have my feet hair from a month ago. Th this is probably something that you guys would want. And last but not least, because we hit a hundred thousand, I'm going to give away a hundred dollars. But I'm going to split that up into 10 sets of $10 bills so that we have 10 winners who can take the cash prize. Here's how to enter. Send me a video through my Instagram DMs explaining to me why you should win a certain prize, okay? You can explain it however way you want. Maybe you want the wax feet strips, explain why. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch those videos on my Twitch stream over the weeks, right? My chat and I are going to determine who deserves to win. And I will announce the winner two weeks from now, which is going to be 
February 15th, I think. February 15th. It'll probably be a Valentine's Day video, and I'll announce the winners there as well. If you win, I'll hit you up, get your mailing information, get your Venmo Cash App, whatever, and you'll win your prize. And I feel like me explaining all that was really long, so uh, I think that's it for the outro. But check out my Discord server, guys. Link in the bio. Check out my Twitch as well. Again, streaming every day at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. And uh, I don't think I have anything else to say. Terry, do you have anything to say? Hmm? Terry, look. Oh. Oh, oh. You guys are all perverts.